I gotta wrap Dana's car before cruising the coast next weekend. It's gonna be a long weekend. Whoa, what's up? I'm gonna be wrapping my wife's BMW. She's got an E89 Z4 M Sport. And ever since I did this to my car, now she wants me to redo her car. She's going to keep it pink. We're going to go two-tone. Pink up top, black at the bottom with the pink trim around it. Put a little design in it, something different. But we got to knock it out quick. Cruising the Coast is coming up next week, and we got to get it done before then. So we can just go ride. Bring the two cars out. Let's wrap a car. So there's how it sits now. There's her busted splitter. But what I'm going to do is follow the natural lines of the car on the hood and give it a two-tone. It's going to be pink up top, black at the bottom, with black running down the middle. I'm going to follow the body lines of the car. And I think I have enough pink right there to get started maybe doing the pillars and the roof. So first thing i got to do is clean this car up. work yeah. and then got dotted lines on the back of this so makes it easier to follow utilize all of it And this is just water, helps the squeegee slide. Okay. You're gonna wrap your car, you need a heat gun. You can get these for about $25, $30 at the hardware store in the paint department. I am not about to try and use a torch like some people do. And they use this for a bunch of things, so it's good to have. That was just an initial cut to get some trash out of the way. I'm going to cut it right next to the rubber strip here. And no, I do not slide a razor across the paint. Nobody does that. People that say that have never wrapped a car.
Sometimes I like to find the groove of my fingernail and get it in under the panel to find exactly what I cut. And that little bit is gone. I'm following this line on the car, so I'm going to lay down some painter's tape to help me see that line better, and then put down some knifeless tape so I can cut the vinyl. Okay. So now I need to measure how big of a piece I need from here to here and from here to here. That's a line where the roof comes apart, it's a convertible. And you want to overhang a little bit each way because you want more material than you actually need so you can stretch it if need be. You don't want to make any mistakes. So I'm going to measure this up. And then I'm going to go and cut a piece out of the wrap that I have left. We'll cover that. I'm going to have to lift the roof up so I can tuck the vinyl wrap in the front and in the back. Reposition it. Get it where you want it. And then as you put the heat gun to it, it'll dry it up and it'll stick. I think... I think this is going to be good. If not, we're going to make it work. I don't have time to mess up. Once I put the heat gun on there, it'll start sticking pretty good. The more curved the car is, the harder it is to work with the vinyl wrap. This car is very, very curved. I'm going to start sticking it right here and work it back. A little water helps me keep me from scratching it. Water on the squeegee. Heat gun gets hot, don't burn yourself. That vinyl has been on the car for three years now, I believe, something like that, two and a half, three years. So it has not faded out in the sun. It still looks good. This looks brighter because I'm underneath the light right there. See? In case y'all are wondering, the Saints are winning. Who that? I'm sure a Carolina fan, and you're probably not wondering.
if you got some big pickup truck or something, it's going to be a hell of a lot easier to wrap than this. If you got a Porsche or a Dodge Viper, good luck. The hardest thing is BMW front bumper so far. I have to heat this up to get the stretch where I want it. It looks hard because sometimes it is. Sometimes it goes on smooth, sometimes you fight it the whole time. What's up, babe? I'm telling Chris Paul, Chris Paul, lies by this time. It's the next Chris Paul before I do not six months around.
I'm not left handed. <laughs> okay, babe. Love you, babe. Thank you for making it beautiful. Take your horn that way, honey. Oh, I'm going to get Some people would lay a whole layer of vinyl wrap across all of this. Don't do that. If you lay it across, wrap your gas cap separately. They lay it across and then they take their razor and they cut around here and then they're only left with a little bit to tuck around the edges. I know that wasn't focused for a second. And down here. But if I wrap this separate, I could wrap around the top. And I could have a lot left over to wrap around here to make the gas cap look good. So I'm about to wrap that completely separate from this whole piece here. That's going to be one piece. But this is going to be one piece. Now I know you're probably wrapping your whole car, but seriously, if you're wrapping your gas cap, do your gas cap separate. Boom. Gas cap. Make sure the car is clean. Make sure the person that owns the car helps you clean it. <laughs> Just showing you putting in all work, how easy this is, how easy it goes on. I can say I did this piece. You can say you did that piece. You're gonna do a little <laughs> bit more too. Always need your help, babe. Alright. So I have no idea how to use this cut tape and honey's trying to teach me. So basically you started a little cut in right, the vinyl right there. You right at the edge right of the edge. where this you where you yeah. know and that it's, line it's is, right? Because we're actually only using from here. Right. To here. So we have we so have a little we play. Have a lot of play. Right. So okay. you put a little slit and you grab the string. And this is like my tape. start, right? Yeah. So you and I want to kind of I want to try to pull this kind of as hard as possible and well, as straight as possible. You want to pull it directly the direction that you're cutting. You don't want to pull to the sides either direction. Right. And should I guess I should hold. You don't have to pull it fast. You just have to I guess pull I should it hold this, you, yes, maybe? to make sure that it doesn't peel up when you pull. Okay. So go ahead and pull. Oh, I'm scared. All right, here we go. There it is. And you just did it. Oh, wow. Now okay. Now take this and just pull it away. Really? Yeah. It can't be that... It's that easy. So you just got a perfectly wow, babe. straight line. Okay. Okay. All right. And, and this, this, none of this matters. Line. None okay. of that matters. That's all going to Wow. Go all right. I was very... I was really scared because I wasn't sure how it... I don't know. I was I was scared. What? <laughs> you just got a perfectly straight line. Okay. All right. And that's how the cut tape works. We have to do one more over there, but we're going to be using the cut tape to make sure that we don't put a razor knife to the paint job. Right. Which we made that mistake early on, oh, no, right? We did that to, we did that to a car where the paint job didn't matter. My right. Old I mean, but still, that's not that's not how you want to make this happen. And the there's a dog here. Super... Hi, not my <laughs> that dog. That is not our dog. Hi, baby. Oh, hello, honey. So this is not my dog. Hi. <laughs> not my dog. This dog followed me around all day one day. My wife's at work, I'm at home. No matter where I went, this dog just walked in the house because the door was open and dog's walking around. Dana texts me and says, hey, how you doing at home? I'm like, well, you know, Angela's keeping me company. I expect her to be like, who the hell's Angela? But she was like, maybe we talked about this and I don't remember. I was like, and she goes, who's Angela? 
Angela Bassett. <laughs> Bassett Hound. Angela Bassett. <laughs> and she thought that was the funniest thing. So we call this Angela Bassett. Also, not our cat. This is not yeah. our dog. This Same dog. Person. It's, an, <laughs> it's an outdoor dog that belongs across the street, but the dog Mommy doesn't know me. that indoors was an option. So now it's always no, in it her does. house. No, it does. Mommy loves it. It is always in her house. Mommy loves Angela. Her name's actually Charlie. And we found out her name was Charlie. But no, we call her Angela because it's <laughs> Angela Bassett Hale. Hi, love. We Not my dog. You. You've been gone, huh? You've been visiting? Oh, goodness. You've been close. I'm going to go as close to this, right? To the bottom of the top of the grill. Yes. So that I have enough to tuck in. You're not right. gonna. You're not gonna take your. Do not take your razor and put it on the paint. Right. That's what everybody thinks online. They're like, oh, they're cutting. The well, yeah, I'm gonna go to the We're plastic. We're cutting the crease. Right. We're not even gonna cut the plastic. You're gonna put it inside that panel gap. Okay, I see. Inside your I razor. See. But, but I'm gonna but aim it, it. Aim it low. Towards the. Okay. And then you'll have excess to tuck under. Like here. Yes. Does that look good? I'm so. Yeah. I'm nervous. All right. Here we go. Ah, uh, see, I went too high. This is a scary thing. All right, now I feel like I'm being forced. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Pull okay. that off. See right there, oh. I feel like I kind of gooked. Well, that's gonna tuck underneath. I'll be okay? It's gonna be okay. Right. And because we have a black car here, it's nothing's gonna show. If this was a white car or a green car, it makes wrapping a car hard. Like my old one? Like your old car. Your old all car right. was white, we wrapped it pink. All right. But that's gonna tuck under. And once you hit it with the heat gun, right. it's going to look clean. Okay. Oh, I see. I see. Okay, you're see? right. So there's room There's room there for some for, play. Yeah, if you, cut, if you cut it slightly wavy, all right. it doesn't matter. It's all, all going right. to get tough. I was super nervous because I'm not, you know, an artist like you. I'm a plain Jane. Okay. All right. And look at that. Look at that. Your wife did a pretty thing. I get to say I did that. <laughs> Yeah, hit it with the heat gun and you'll right. be all done because the heat makes it stick. Well, that's very pretty. Okay, and thank you. And of course, you. any dirt that's on here, right. it's because we've been wiping it, we've been wrapping it and all. Once we're done, we'll wash it off of and that's going to all be clean. All right, what do you think? Beautiful. Your wife did a thing. I'm going to be so proud of myself. All right. So, the sharp lines of the car, we're following that pattern. So, I lay down painter's tape because painter's tape doesn't leave any residue and then we laid down the cutting tape to follow that line one. A glove one. I'm so scared nope 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 yeah that's how close you cut this I uh, didn't mean to cut it that close. Your mama cut it close. And there we are. Mm. Y'all want to do shots? Let's do shots. Everybody! Well, look, well, I got a big John. You got a big John. Stupid. Stupid. <laughs> I'm not, I don't know what you want me to do. I'm holding it. What do you, what do you want me to do? I told you, I am, you're the professional here. I am the ding dong apprentice that doesn't get paid anything. That's not a thing. And I, and I get to say, like, I don't know, he did a great thing. It was amazing. Tell me what to do. You want me to, you want me to know, but I don't know. Hey, stop off seriously. Seriously. That's funny. Oh, you should keep on pressing. <laughs> they need to know the truth. Yeah. If you wrap your car with your wife, you might get a divorce. She's a little big. They need to know the truth. Don't do this with a loved one. Hey, where's the picture? No, don't do it. Can I pull it up? Stretch. You won't too much. 
I've got to have enough money for the rent. I mean, that's all my rent. And when I got no arrows, so that's the thing. Okay, now, that one. And you have a rifle. You always have to keep up. Wrapping the car is not going. But when you're done, you're going to go. When you're done, though. It's fine. Thank you. Oh, yeah, I know. Don't worry about the person that left it. That might just end up being there. Find out. There. I think because this thing just so thin, it might be getting a little hard. You can put that up. Do you think those marks are going to be sort of coming out of the air? You see the disc? Mm -hmm. Might be. We have to clean it up the sink. Well, once again, it's one of those things that you clean up that nobody else notices. Got it. Get it off back here. Okay. That's why he gave you so much extra, just in case anything messes up. Get it off, now pull it away. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Well, no. Look, I didn't get no, quite all good. of it, did I? I mean, you got to get your little bitty fingers on it. Same with everybody. There it is. Now, grab this and hold this. All right. I'm nervous. Grab this. Uh-huh. I got, I got my finger here. Hold you. There you go. Now pull it. There you go. Directly. Babe, you have to grab it. I got it. it. I'm going to get it right here. Holy crap. That is so crazy. Now, I don't have the knife. I'm going to cut that low. Oh, well, you pulled the tape. That wasn't what I was. Pull this. Look at a beautiful line. Don't pull it up because it's got cut back here. Oh. There it goes. Look at that. Look so, at that line. Holy crap. The cutting tape is way down here, so it doesn't matter what I do. That's where I'm trying to cut from, so I'm just going to cut a slit. None of this matters. I got me a nice slit. I'm going to grab the knifeless tape if I can get my fingers on it. Grab the string, put that down before I cut myself. Now I got the string. I'm gonna hold that. I'm gonna pull it back. Look. Boom. Cut completely off. And boom. There's a line. And here goes the tape and the painter's tape. One move. Look at y'all. Now you got a nice, nice line. Hold my finger along it, press it down, make sure it's good. And before I'm done, I'm gonna take the heat gun over everything because the heat makes it of stick. Of course, of course. But I gotta cut the back edge over there. I gotta cut over here. It's all good. Got the first big piece on. Got some minor imperfections in it, but I ain't gonna point them out. And like every car from five feet away, it looks great. About to hit that line up all the way down the side. But you can kind of get the idea of what we're doing now. Do y'all see the freaking design right here? That's the body line. It's going to follow all the way up and meet up there. That's what we're doing. But it is 1 in the morning now, and I need to go inside and take three shots of something. And go sleep. Sleep? Sleep is for the week. Sleep when you're dead. Okay, go get my go get my wrap off your car. Oh my god. The next day, the vinyl stripes, the pink stripes that were on the car, were on there for 19 months. I just looked up pictures of my camera to see. So you see that it does not damage the paint. You can see right here where she hasn't cleaned. It hasn't been cleaned. You could almost make out the line where the stripe was. It's darker there because it protected the paint. But when we clean it up real good, you won't even see it. It'll blend in. Up here, it's been cleaned. So you can't even see the lines. I'm going to take the mirror off the car. It makes wrapping this part here easier and the mirror itself. Getting under here to cut is not easy with the mirror in place. 
Love bugs are driving me nuts today. I gotta keep swatting them away before I lay vinyl wrap on top of them. Oh, love bug. Go away. Some people like laying an entire sheet down the side of the car and then wrapping it. They'll take their knife and slide it down the panel gaps. I don't like doing that. I don't want to put the knife that close to my car. Plus, I don't want to be working down here and worried about if that up there is sticking or whatever. So I'll do each individual piece. And without sliding your knife down the middle, it leaves you with more material to make sure you get a good wrap around the back side. So that's how you do that properly. This side of the car is done. Follows that sexy line that the Z4 has. Gonna do the other side. I'm not too sure about the mirror yet. That's the way my wife wanted it. We'll see. And I gotta clean up the bottom and I got a new splitter to put on it. One side of the car down. Whoa, it's Saturday night. I think I'm going to finish this tonight and have a week to play. I'm still going to have to do the splitter tomorrow or through the week. I'll put it on at the end of the week maybe. And I'm about to knock this piece out right here. The man. Doing a good job. And this is all the trash. All the trash. And... That's how much wrap I have left. I got a lot. So I got enough to do the job. It's late Saturday night. Done all but the hood. And we decided we're going to wrap the diffuser back here. So I got to do the diffuser and the hood. Oh yeah, and I still got the splitter to do. But I can knock that out through the week. This is going to be done. Look at that. It's Sunday morning, about to knock out this last piece. 
getting them lines lined up to look as straight as possible. Wrapping the whole hood would have been easier if I just wrapped across. You got to take a lot of measurements to get everything right right there, but I honestly don't feel like wrapping that bumper at all. So, I got some tape laid down. I'll put down the cutting tape, the knifeless tape, and I got some measurements. We're going to cut a big piece of vinyl and lay it down. So we're going to like stop tape. Yeah, we'll both we'll back. Let's try and work it. So we can get all stuff back here. And I've covered everything right now. Yes, I'm going to hang over up here. I'm going to hang up there. Let's, can you come hold it right here? Just hold it right there and turn it off. Pull it back off and we'll stick it in place so it doesn't move. Your face is not on camera, Professor. Yes. Did the camera's aiming down. Yeah, you're, you're cut off at the shoulders. Doesn't matter. We've got most of it anyway. Maybe we put this in fast forward. Just trying to show a little something. There we go. I'm going to pack and you kind of Yeah, I guess we'll pack for a moment. I just wanted to turn. Once I lay it down, see that I turned so much just now. I'm going to stick this. I don't know if it was. It's not even the right place anymore. Let's try it. Let's just stick it anyway. It seems like it's covering right there. Oh, yeah. Good thing. I should have. Whoa. Is this a lottery ticket? Did you win a lottery not telling me? Are you leaving me? Right, we've got four today. Yeah. Come pull all your stuff going. Actually, why would you take a stuff? You won a lottery. Fuck my stuff. I don't even like my stuff. I don't even like my stuff. Buy better stuff. The cat's
Yeah. Actually, this is really good wrapper. I like this. It's not needed too much. It's a combination of the heat and you pressing down on it that gets the vinyl wrapped to stick. So after you're done with a panel, just kind of heat it up and it's going to help it stick. Plus this car parks outside in the sun while she's at work all day. So the sun's going to bake it down. It's going to cause it to make it stick better. But before she takes off driving with it, and we wash it, I can make sure to put the heat gun on it. Rear diffuser is done. The lighting in here isn't the best, but all I got to do now is the front splitter. I got to go to work tonight and a couple of nights this week and then back to days. And I can put the splitter on at the end of the week. I do not fit. Time to put a new front splitter on this E89 Z4. New splitter.
That looks a little bit better. Okay, That is it. This thing is done. Best his and hers around. What's your girl drive? <laughs>